greetings of the day another important means that we must have with us to remain in the anointing is obedience obedience to the word of god and obedience to the holy spirit in the life of jesus we find that he always said i have come not to do my will but the will of the one who sent me and he was obedient to the point of the death the life of the saints like saint augustine saint francis assisi saint francis xavier saint mother teresa we find that they were obedient to just one single word and that brought tremendous change in their life and they could bring fire on the earth because of that one word of god at times we read a lot of bible and we know many word of god but we are not able to use the sword of the spirit the word of god effectively because saint james tells us that we are not called to be the hearers of the word of god but doers of the word of god and therefore we need to obey the word of god to use this sword of the spirit in the right way another thing is that we need to be obedient to the holy spirit Now, obedience at times is very difficult and therefore holy spirit is the one who is given for us so that we may be obedient to the word of god and to the holy spirit in acts of the apostles chapter 5 verses 32 it said that holy spirit is given as a gift to the one who does the will of god and therefore let us ask the holy spirit to come and help us to be obedient towards the word of god and the holy spirit so that we may be effective in our evangelization